Here it is, it's available, it's in its own repo. I've also copied the source code over. Bansy 2 HTML, this gives you the whole CSS file with it. Extremely opinionated. I wrote this tool specifically for my website related to the YSAP series, but it works and it works beautifully. You can echo code that has ANSI escape sequences in, in it to Bansy HTML and it outputs everything. And it even says like, oh, generated by Bansy, whatever. And it gives you a whole bunch of examples. So you can run like LS and pipe it to that and you can get all sorts of stuff. Implemented in pure bash, absolutely zero external utilities are used. Uh, will error whenever it doesn't encounter anything that it knows. Uh, reads input for standard in, writes to standard out. Hey, that's awesome. No inline styling. This tool opts to use CSS class names and stuff like this. So you kind of have to pull in the, uh, the, the CSS thing. Long story short, I will show you what it looks like because it's a super cool program. I could probably make a video dedicated to Bansy to HTML. Because if I just, let's say, let's run ls color equal always this, I can pipe it to tools, Bansy to HTML. And there we go. It's taken ls output and turned it into that. Um, I don't remember, I think I gave it dash capital H. What does that even do? It's been so long since I've used this code. Dash capital H, don't omit the HTML program or header content. Oh yeah, I have that little header at the top that says, this was generated by Bansy or whatever. Dash H just makes it not omit this. Oh yeah, I couldn't omit this because I stored it in a thing. Oh my God, it's been so long since I've touched this code, guys, but a lot of people have been asking me to go over this, so I'm happy to jump through it. So this converts HTML, or ANSI, into HTML, which is super nice. If you've ever seen my bash style guide, style.ysap.sh, this is what it looks like. You can actually load this website in your browser, too. There we go, style.ysap.sh, and it looks exactly the same. It's because it is exactly the same. I rendered on the text, I rendered the text on the terminal first, and then I pipe it to Bansy to HTML to actually generate this nice little HTML page you're looking at. In fact, if you look at this HTML page without a CSS file, it looks like this. And hey, that's actually pretty cool. I don't know, I like it, I think it's neat. Um, so yeah, that's how I generated that.